Yo, YouTube, what's going down? It's your boy Potsy, and today I'm bringing you some Madden 15 Ultimate Team Mutt, whatever you want to call it. And uh, you saw in the last episode, uh, I kind of uh, made a kid rage, and then I got uh, uh, st just stupidity, you know, fell into my hands, and I lost the game. But it's okay, I'll bounce back. It's week four, and uh, hopefully, I can. Uh, Hopefully, just bring him home the, the title. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> hopefully we just have finally have a Super Bowl win. The objective for me is that oh, as I get destroyed. Damn, how you guys doing? Cause uh, Jamal Charles is going night night. He went to sleep. He went to bed. He bye. It's cool though. But um, as uh, <laughs> damn, it's just destroyed. <laughs> But it's okay because we get the ball back. As you see, Afro Moore is here with the play action. Stafford looking back and just throwing to, I think that was Dennis Pitta. I think it was. Some of the times I don't even know my tight ends. But you see right there, just get destroyed on that blitz. So I had to take the field goal. But it's all good. I'm, I'm good. But, um, how you guys doing? You guys doing pretty good? Pretty good? Everything good? Okay. All right. The, the point of the objective for me in, in Mutt is that I never... Have I did never won a Super Bowl in any of Ultimate Team? As I, oh my God, laying the boom, baby! I am just <clears throat> actually both of us are laying the lumber right now. We are just just making everybody fumble out here. As you see, Matt Stafford throwing a beautiful pass to Larry Fitz. Just we're just finding we're just finding people. As you see, that stand my fingers. That's how we're doing. Look at that little little dump pass, man. And we up ten nothing, man. That that was pretty sick. I ain't gonna lie, but look at that user pick. All me. That's all me for real. That's Drake. Shout out to Drake Armis, bro. Champagne pop. But um, this was so. Now I made a kid rage quit, as usual. So hopefully in week five I can finally, finally make a make it just a, a, a kid rage wit wit. I just say quite wit, dude. I am. Oh my god. I'm not stopping. That's funny because I want to go back and be like quite wit. I just made quite wit. Oh man, I'm stupid. But <laughs> as you see right here, the next game, we got another opponent who is the Philadelphia Eagles as well. But that's cool. He's white, as you can tell, because the one he's the one who uh, got the pick. So you can tell which one sucks. That's me in the green. <laughs> but uh, but the objective here is I need to win a Super Bowl. And all the times I played Mutt, I think it's like oh, when I started playing Mutt. I think 2012. That's when I started. I think it started like in 2010. I was like, this is stupid, and then didn't care for it, and then uh, I started getting into mud, and NCAA came out. I think it was 13, I believe, and then 14 came out, and I was like, alright, well, now I kind of like it, because then I got into uh, Madden, yeah, Madden 25 was last year, and that's when it was a real, little bit of fun for me. Um, it's just that I kind of like came at the wrong time. Everyone had like 99 Leon Sandcastles at like a quarterback, running back, free safety. It was like, oh, this is stupid. But, you know, it's cool. That's what happens. That was the end of the season. That's why. So I really didn't know what, what to expect, especially in Ultimate Team. I was so used to doing head-to-head -head rankings and franchises and all that stuff. But look at Jamal Charles, though. He's so fast that I can't control him. That's <laughs> that's how fast he is, and I, I love him to death. The dude's a beast, and I wish he came to Philly. I mean, I just I, I like a, I like McCoy. Don't disrespect, but like having oh my god, <laughs> where's your users, yo? That's the one guy. Damn, I totally forgot. In the last video, I remember saying that uh, Darren Sproles and Jamal Charles are two-headed monster. The three-headed monster is new. It's Demarco and uh, Darren Sproles and uh, Jamal Charles. That. That's like a blue eyes white dragon from Yu-Gi-Oh. If people know that, I will shake your hand because that was my ish back in the day. People were used to Pokemon. I was too, but like Yu-Gi-Oh, bro. If you, had, if, you had, if you had three cards of the blue eyes white dragon, you were gonna be the top kid at school, man. She so get the fourth down here because I got no fourth down defense because I'm stuck in a loop because I suck. That's cool though. You know me, I suck. But yeah, I mean like Yu-Gi-Oh, man. That was my ish back in the day. Oh my god, did you see they limb laying the lower Sam Shields, man? That dude was a beast. But once again here, fourth down, he's gonna throw that dump, but I said, uh-uh. No, 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 not today. Get my McKembe Matumbo here and look at is that Ladarius Webb? No. 
getting the pick six up by a touchdown feeling lucky feeling good I mean hopefully we can bring this win in but like it is what it is man but once again I'm just oh my god people have stone hands but as you look at his team his team's really not that good He's got the the worst quarterback in the game, B.J. Daniels, I think it is. I remember doing the quarterback challenge with him, and I didn't succeed. But this guy's having a better better game than I did when I have it. If you know what, I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make the title of this um a new challenge. Find a challenge for me to do, and I will do it. You know, if if you want to do the worst quarterback, if you really didn't see the episode, you can always go back. But if you want to see a new one. Go right ahead. You know, leave, leave a comment. I have a nice attempt right there. But leave a comment for a challenge. You know, I got to do I gotta do one play only. You know, one play on offense, one play on defense. Or, you know, something like that. You know, something where it's challenging and hopefully I can win and get the victory. Especially in Mutt where I'm trying to win the Super Bowl here. Because that's smart, right? Don't care. I want to do it. So, you guys, if you see in the comments, you know, write, type in the comments of a challenge what you want to see. And I'll try to do it, man. And, um... I think in the in the next year, I also want to do is a, a giveaway, PSN cards, Xbox One cards, something like that. You know, it's a giveaway. You know, type in the comments of random stuff. But um, you know, usually I'll make a video saying that stuff when it's gonna happen, because I want to show respect. And also, it's, I mean, it's free. It's a free card of anything. It could be twenty dollars worth of something on the PSN or Xbox Live, or it can be a three month uh, membership, play online if you have an Xbox. You know, I guess. I guess, yeah, Xbox One and PSN, but look, damn, I think that's Stan, Stanley or Stanky, I think that was, yeah, I forget his name though, but I mean, that dude, is, that's a pretty good card as well, it's pretty, really, really fast, um, yeah, I want to do some giveaways, I, I mean, I know my channel's small, but anything that, to make the, the channel grow is it gets a touchdown here, so we now we have a ball game, okay, as my good friend Dwayne The Rock Johnson said, just bring it. And that's what I'm going to do here. Okay. All right. Remember I said that? Yeah, I changed my mind. I ain't going to do that. It's cool, though. But look at Jamal Charles. I'm J JK, man. Get that first down, kid. I will get this touchdown here because I am a beast. Look at DeMarco, though, man. Look at him. And that's a standard gold card, too. Standard. Dude's a beast out here. I, I wish I had his elite card because I heard that one's really, really good. That and the MVP, Andre Ellington. Because the reason why Andre Elton's MVP card is so good is because he came from Clemson. Because Clemson was number one. <clears throat> was that out loud? Because that's true. As you see, Alfred Moore is here just bulldozing himself into the end zone and getting it in. So now we are pretty much all we have to do is just coast and just flat out win. You know, you know do well on defense and... Uh, Pretty much just kill the clock on offense. It's pretty much simple here. Look at BJ Dan. He's just throwing the dump passes and they're working. When I say dump passes, most likely that's probably like him just holding down the circle button <laughs> or the player that he sees because this dude has no, no, not a damn thing worth of uh, a throwing power nor accuracy. But I mean, that, that is what it is, man. If you're the worst quarterback, of course that's going to happen. But uh, I can't complain. He's using the worst quarterback. You know, he's trying to work. He's doing better than I am because he's getting these, you know, these fourth down completions, and I can't do nothing about it. And <laughs> that sucks because I I know I can do something about it, but I don't. And that and then that can lead to him winning because I'm a jackass when it comes to that. But nonetheless, too, my players are not like my defense is just not catching anything. Nothing's clicking, and everything should be clicking now, especially on a team like this. They can easily get lucky chances, but as you see right here, I'm picking a play, and he said, you know what, I had enough. It's been real. I know I'm not going to win because most likely I'm going to kill the clock. It is what it is, man. He did rage quit. So we came off of these two, you know, these two games right now. We're doing good. We're on a roll. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll leave a, you know, I'll leave a comment and all that other stuff, the count, challenge and all that. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. I'm out. Peace. I think I just... Ow! I just hurt my finger. Jesus Christ!